it's your girl Jazz coming to you from Charleston, South Carolina. That's right, you see it, we're out here, and guess what? We are about to be going on a trip with the Thai Tours over in Tanzania, Africa. Yes, that's right. Oh, what do I do? Yeah. <laughs> I do hair, baby. <laughs> I love everything about it. I do lots of braids, lots of locks, and I've, I've done it since a little girl, you know. Um, I was one of those ones that took interest since the age of, what, three, four years old. Um, I was very serious about that craft, you know, and it uh, it showed in my, <laughs> in my life skills. Um, it's just being able to help people in those ways, being able to to help change someone's mindset, to be able to help them with how they look at themselves, with their self-confidence, um, just, it's self-esteem, you know, like it's all of those things in one packet, like one packet, you know, just be able to do that. So basically how I, you know, how I learned was first of all, there was a lot of women that had you know, braided hair and you know, they did things with everyone's hair. And so I thought that that was like the beautiful, that was that was beautiful to be able to share that. Um, everyone knows who braided hair pretty much like they're sitting for like hours, you know, and it's a great time to actually bond um, with someone. Uh, people don't actually realize that hairstyles tell stories, hairstyles uh, communicate with other people. Like you could, you could get certain places you could go where if a woman's hairstyle was a certain way, guess what? They were married, or they were with a child, or you know, they were um, they were about to be married, or you know, um, they just simply being able to make a difference in someone's life based off of the skill that you know how to do that that means a lot. <laughs> so having the opportunity to travel the world with Thai tours and be able to have those moments with the youth or you know just people in general um to be able to exchange those gifts that we've been pretty much like making sure that we retained over so many years uh i know for a fact the Gullah Geechee people period have one of the longest uh running retention rates you could imagine in the country honestly speaking so look that up fact check that you know what I'm saying but for us to be able to hold on to information that long and make it make a difference in our lives and we're still doing it we're still doing that skill set to this day yeah definitely worth exchanging that knowledge you know so um I'm excited <laughs> I I am so excited like I can't wait to meet everybody and I hope that everybody's excited too because this is about to be a moment in time that we're definitely gonna remember, okay? Yes. <laughs>